Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Emperor Series 888. My name is Tanya. All right, happy new year, everybody. It is New Year's Eve, and I hope you have a safe New Year's, okay? Yeah, that's right. In the comfort of your own home, or get home early. You know how it is tonight. The popo gonna be out, baby. Just saying. Be safe, don't drink and drive. All right, so let's do this reading. I'm hearing from Scandal. Goodbye to you. I hope that's just the song on the radio, baby. And that's not going to be for you, but we'll see. Goodbye to you. Yeah, so read the song. I'm not going into it. Let's get this party started. Pray in the spirit. Spirit, guides, and angels of your whitest light, please give me a clear message for the collective, one that brings healing, hope, and understanding of their situation. Please protect me as I channel these messages. Please protect my beautiful collective. Amen, baby. All right, every rose has its thorn is on as well. What's going on in this, this reading? It's supposed to be New Year, New Year. What's going on? I hope you're having a wonderful morning, afternoon, and evening. It's raining where I'm at. Maybe it's nice and sunny where you are. I hope you're enjoying it. I hope you have a blessed New Year. Okay, even though we're talking about every rose has its thorn, we're talking about goodbye to you. Yes, okay, these things can happen in readings. Collective, any energy, any sign, energy does not have a gender. But if I say he or she, please excuse and forgives. It is not meant to exclude anybody. All right, I'm waiting for my Chinese food, baby. So we're here in the parking lot. And we're doing a reading because I love you that much. Give me a reading here. Please, Spirit, give me a overall energy. Thank you, Spirit. And like on the way in, it gives me an energetic donation to the channel. And I so appreciate that. Thank you for all of your likes and your subscribes. I love you out there in YouTube land. Yeah, you. Timeless readings. Timeless readings. Truth. I live my truth. And I'm hearing somebody ain't living their truth. And this is why it's Goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to you. Mm. How could I love someone like the one I see in you? Mm -hmm. I remember the good times, baby, now and the bad times too. Yep. These past few weeks of holding on, the days are short, the nights are long. Guess it's better to say goodbye to you. Yeah, somebody's saying it. Let's get into the tarot. I got two different types of tarot. And let's see what is going on in the goodbye land. Somebody wants to let this go. Yeah, because every rose has its dawn. Every night has its dawn. Mm -mm -mm -mm. What is happening in the new year, people? What is going on? All right, the moon, secrets, illusions. Important psychic insights are happening here events are revealing itself yeah and somebody's releasing their fears somebody's releasing their fears and releasing this person because the truth is being revealed about what's happening in the background there's an awakening happening whether it's between you and your person i could be saying you and meaning your person I'm saying your person i mean you take what resonates and leave the rest if the shoe don't fit he quit baby but there's an awakening happening in this connection and somebody had to go into hermit mode meditation quiet meditation self-reflection introspection and figure this out discovering themselves discovering what they want and what they don't want anymore and maybe what they don't want is lies and deceptions somebody hasn't been honest with them and maybe this person you could be finding out that your person's not true to you and you're like goodbye to you yep six of air gemini libra aquarius Things are looking up for you. The end of a difficult situation is happening and you might be even taking a trip or moving away from a situation, you know? A painful situation is what I'm hearing. A painful situation that a person puts you under. Ace of water, which is, what well, Scorpio, Pisces, and Cancer. Falling in love. Or the resurgence of a relationship. Spiritual growth. A new home. So like I said, you might be moving into a new home or moving away from a situation but you might be falling in love with somebody new is what i'm hearing four of earth taurus virgo capricorn too cautious giving to those less fortunate you might be a giver or somebody might be holding on too tightly to their cash too tightly to their coin too tightly in general to people situations is what i'm getting here let's go into the rabbit hole of my deck and let's see what happened in this situation. Why you're saying goodbye or why every rose has its thorn. Let's go. But I'm hearing that, what is it? Enough is enough. 
and too much is good for nothing. That's what I'm hearing. Yeah, you just had enough. You had enough of somebody's lies. You had enough of somebody's deceitful, manipulative ways. Yeah, and you're just done. Done, done, done. It's like too much is good for nothing. And that's how you felt. So you're walking away. This person doesn't want you to walk away, though. They really don't. They're trying to hold on to you, hold on to your energy. Thank you, spirit. You've changed. Hello, the cards are not lying here. You have changed and you're sick of it. Sick of nothing. You, maybe they didn't give you anything. Yeah. Well, codependent. Maybe this person was codependent on you. Or you were too codependent on this person and you changed. Reconciliation, though. This person wants to reconcile with you. Yeah. Hear me out. They want you to hear them out. On the radio right now is we don't have to take our clothes off to have a good time. Yeah. Maybe that's all they came at you as sexual energy and you were just like, I'm more than just a piece of ass. And maybe they didn't realize that. I wish I could take back my words. Maybe they said some harsh words to you. They fear change and stayed stuck while you move forward and they're seeing you move forward and they don't want you to they were controlling you yeah manipulating you dark energy is at play here maybe they're in their dark energy and you move towards the light but this is your soulmate saying here yeah. equal give and take they did not equally give to this connection they're recognizing their mistake now wrong choice amen they made a wrong choice they made a wrong choice in dealing with you they're making a wrong choice we're juggling other people because we're at juggling's at the bottom of the deck here secrets are going to be revealed about this juggling about who, what they've been doing and who they've been doing it with behind your back there's a win at all cost now your person is not going to give up they may be in their dark energy but they're grabbing onto yours spell works at play there are people in this situation and it could be this person that they were juggling that's using spell work to hold on to this your person and maybe that's why they chose this other person instead of you. This per your person's in a toxic energy, and that's why they allowed that to happen. What does it say here? Haters, amen. Okay, can't make this crap up. There are haters, hidden enemy at the bottom of the deck. Oh my God, for real. Yeah, there's the thorns. There's haters doing spell work, winning at all costs. They will do whatever the hell it takes. It's toxic posse. Secrets are being revealed about this toxic posse to your person who was juggling, who made wrong choices, who believed in the wrong people. Yeah, there was no equal give and take, but this is your soulmate. I can't make this crap up even if I wanted to. Can't do it. Can't do it. All right, let's get into this other tarot deck and see more about this. The secret hater spirit. Come on now. But you are the sun. You are the rain. You are what makes this person's life worth living and they love you that's what i'm hearing i'm hearing that song from lionel richie it's crazy yet they didn't show you that and they took you for granted they just expected you to always be there putting up with your crap it's like they didn't see you worse they saw what you could do for them but they didn't see what they could do for you they liked what you did for them. Maybe you did take your clothes off. But that's all they did. They took that as all there was to this connection because that's how they approach relationships. Take your clothes off and we'll see what happens. Uh, let's see. Four cups in the reverse. They want to take this to a different level. They want to approach this in a different way. They want to approach you in a different way. But they feel like you're guarded and you're not going to put up with their nonsense because you put up boundaries. Good for you. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They want to take the courage to come toward you. They want to have the courage. Page of, page of Swords, but they see you as guarded. But maybe they were guarded against you at first because they didn't want to show emotions to you. But now they want to talk to you. Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Yeah, Six of Swords in the reverse. Now they're in stuck energy and you're not with them. You sailed away. Five of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, a lot of hardships and poverty and loss has happened since you walked away from them. You've been in your hermit mode, introspection, 
thinking about this connection and what you want and what you no longer want or no longer serves you. Two of wands, two paths and decision. You had to make that choice and they have to make that choice. Ace of swords. They want to communicate with you though. They want to tell you their truth. It's a, it's a painful truth and that's why it's been stuck energy because they didn't know how to express that to you or be honest with you. They don't know how to be honest with you about it. They don't know if you're going to accept their honesty. They might, you might not believe them anymore. Seven of Wands in the reverse, a lot of obstacles in this connection because of haters, because of spell work, because of dark energy at play. Because this Queen of Pentacles, this person that they went towards, this moody, suffocating, naggy, materialistic, jealous person that they chose instead of you. Either of you. Is keeping them stuck. That's what I'm hearing here. Four of Pentacles, control, material gain. This is what was at play here. Your person had something that this Queen of Pentacles wanted. Their money, their status. And that's what they are keeping them stuck because they want them to keep filling their coffers. Seven of Cups, lots of options and choices your person had. And yikes, spirit. Things are just flying out. But you're the queen of cups. You were always loving to this person and generous to this person. And they took that as weakness on your part. And they accepted that. And they never gave anything in kind. Five of swords. Yeah, it's an empty victory because they don't got you. The lovers is a choice between usually between two people. They chose poorly. And they know it now. Page of cups in the reverse. Yeah, and it was an emotional immaturity on their part. Any more spirit before we end it? Anything happening that's going to happen in the future, any actions going to be taken, they want to come towards you. They're very fearful of what's going to happen, but they have to give up this Queen of Pentacles in the reverse that's using them. Using and abusing them. The chariot, victory, you're going to get your victory. Hard work is paying off for you, Seven of Pentacles. Victory again, Six of Wands. Yeah, you're going to get victory and success. They, are they want to travel towards karma waters with you. Ace of Pentacles, they want a new opportunity with you. Yeah, but for a long time they made bad decisions and trust was at, trust issues was at play. And now you have trust issues with this person. They were holding on to the past three of wands. They want to confess, as I mentioned before, seven of swords. This is the queen of the king of cups to your queen of cups. This is a vibration by a yeah. vibrational match. But I mean they have matured since this. Past, present, or future energy could be at play. Eight of Cups. They abandoned you. And you walked away. And it's been difficult ever since. But this is a challenge. And there's free will at play. You have a choice to make. Just like they do. So when they come towards you, and they will, you have to make a choice whether you want to go towards this person or a new option is coming in. That's all I have for you. Happy New Year, everybody. Like and subscribe and join my tribe. I'd love to have you. Until next time. Until next year. Be safe out there, my friends. Be very blessed.